Tom Everhart is a dynamic and prolific artist who is best known for a truly unique distinction. He is the only artist in the world with full creative rights to the beloved Peanuts, created by Charles M. Schultz. It is a story of a long and special friendship, and of an artistic vision that elevated what many saw as just a comic strip to its rightful place as fine art. The paintings using Charles Schultz's comic strip, Peanuts, as subject matter began and replaced the skeleton and nature-related paintings in 1988. The inspiration came to Everhart in Johns Hopkins Hospital where he was undergoing several operations for stage 4 colon and liver cancer. Everhart recalls lying in a hospital bed surrounded by enough flowers to open up a florist shop, piles of art books, and a stack of Peanuts comic strips sent to him by Schultz. The light streaming in front of the window almost projected the new image of his future. Schultz inspired paintings on the wall. All the images in Everhart's work are in some respect derived from Schultz's Peanuts comic strip. In 1991, Charles Schultz and United Media drafted a legal agreement to allow Everhart to use the subject matter from Schultz's peanut strips in his art for the term of his life. Everhart did not squander the opportunity to produce as many quality pieces as he could. He was very passionate about keeping Sparky's memory alive through his work. One of his artworks, done in 2015, titled Maxi Taxi, is about 30 and a half inches by 39 inches. It was created with G. Clay on deckled paper. G. Clay is combining pigment-based inks with high-quality paper to achieve G. Clay prints that are of superior quality, light fastness, and stability. Tom's process included large rhythmic brush strokes, leading us to believe that he used this technique of a la prima, which is when the artist paints very quickly, as well as robura brushwork, which is applying paint with liveliness and gusto. Oh, it's no wonder Everhart's technique is related to that of Van Gogh and Picasso. Exactly, and surprisingly, even though he finished this piece quickly, the motivation behind it is beautiful. He was traveling with his friends and observed one of the daughters playing in her toy car. He was fascinated by how comfortable her arm was draped over the car with her hand firmly grasping the steering wheel. According to Tom, she looked like a veteran taxi driver. Her name is Maxie, short for Maxwell. Wow, that is an adorable twist of events that inspired that work. Interestingly enough, his inspiration for Big Papa, which was created in 2013, while painting in his studio with music, he often selected songs by Notorious Big, or AKA Biggie Smalls, whose song Big Papa spoke to him profoundly. Also, a quote by Albert Einstein, creativity is the residue of time wasted. The meaning of this quote is to relax and just let your mind wander. Ah, I see this very thing happening because Snoopy has started to drift to the side as he's entering a relaxing rhythm. Probably like what Everhart felt while listening to his music. Hmm, so I'm guessing that's what the dots symbolize? Like rhythm or something? Exactly! This technique is called Surat, which is using dots of unblended color. In this case, it is to express movement. Everhart got the idea for this by watching birds fly above the sea in rows that waved up and down. Snoopy is portrayed in a blissful state with a huge grin from ear to ear. Wow, speaking of huge, this painting is 84 inches by 128 inches. It is one of several paintings in a series called Rollin' with the Homies. Each artwork had their similarities, but the differences are vast. This truly was an amazing artist who mastered different styles and techniques. In Maxi Taxi, he almost rushed most of the aspects of the painting to create the perception of the taxi in motion. Similarities include that both characters are shown in a relaxed, carefree manner. The forces of physics are at work in each of the paintings also 
because of Snoopy's ear positions corresponding with either gravity or wind dynamics. Yeah, yet in Big Papa, he takes his time to make every individual dot with a relaxing tone to them. Likewise, Snoopy is painted in a relaxed state, almost mimicking his creator. No holiday. It's time I'm gonna kick that football clear to the moon! Well, that went well. Yeah, good thing we didn't fall on our backs. See you next time, folks.